Yeah, so I have just been having the most terrible time in 2024. When I went to the last video of 2023, I just wanted 2024 to be normal. Just be normal. Don't want to forget. Just be normal, I said. Just be normal. I have had every disaster ever. It's been two months. It's 1st of March today. And don't even ask me if I have recovered yet. I don't know if I'll ever recover from being sick. My mother also saw that I posted that whole whiny list of everything that has gone wrong. And I thought she'd be mad that I was whining on the internet, but she just like, <sighs> yeah. We've all been having a bad time in 2024. The bathroom is still broken. I haven't gone to the bathroom in peace in two months. Good. <laughs> okay, stop. No, they're not finding. We're here to do chapter. Good morning. Welcome to... Wait till you know what is the... What is... Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Groove is in the art. Welcome to... Year 8, chapter 17. Your first major ROCC case to recover. The curse quill is heating up. It is it connected to Ruby's death? She's not dead. I think that's all but confirmed now. It's time to go undercover to make a major breakthrough. Uh, oh yeah, we needed to now sneak into the social club because umbrage is a is a B word. And you can you find the information you're looking to for before before your cover is blown. Plus, Aran, the friend takes a surprising thing. That 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 has to be Ismelda, right? Please be Ismelda. She ran away while she was eating a rainbow cake and but I want her to finish her cake. No one is making fun of you, Ismelda. We love you. Good morning. Let's get into the chapter before I start playing again. I mean, unless they buy out the whole place for the meeting of the social club, I can just go to flower puffs and pretend I'm just getting a cake. I think it's for the best we're not at the social club anymore, given that this dude is here and this dude is here. So Madam Umbridge pulled quite a few strings to get the secret club into such a public place. Oh, I see. Oh, so they oh, so they do buy out the whole place. I see. I had to interview with I had to interview with Amrish three times before she accepted him back into the club. Rude. Jesus Christ! Yeah, you guys need to ban if you see that that is listening over big. Um yeah, um yeah, we need to just ban Umbridge from being the president. My club membership was never in doubt. You shut up, you don't count. <coughs> oh, water went down the wrong pipe. Oh, yeah, I have no high hopes. I have, I have, no, not high hopes. I have no hope for the rest of 2024. I, I don't see Tonks yet. Then again, it should be anyone. No, I'm not crying. I need enough time to talk to the short club members. They've all been impacted by the fraud I'm investigating. I have the name Felix Roofs as starting point. Does he connect the curse quill with the art gallery fire? Ah, there's Tonks. Because... Because. Hey, did you ask Rats if you could impersonate her? What does Rai you I see Rats smell is weird. Hi Rats. Wait. Did you say watcha? Oh. Oops. Hmm. It's me, Tonks. Ah, I see, I see the resemblance now. Rath hasn't been that excited about anything in her entire life. Hmm. Oh good point, I'll be sure to tone it down. Hmm. Oh well you were right, Srahi. The meeting is taking place at Flapas. Now it makes sense if Adam Umbridge told me I wouldn't get cake after kicking me out of the social club. We, we do not care, I want Jay's cake. I'm surprised he chose as a public place for a secret club. Hmm. I just found out about this club, but it seems like Umbridge is trying to make a good first impression. Yeah, she's not making a very good first impression if she kicked out Celestino Warbeck and she had to interview three times. Y'all need to just ban her for being president again. What a sweet place for such a sour person. Alright, let's go over the plan quickly. If we don't have much time, if Umbridge sees me, I'll be kicked out. Hmm. Alright, I'll go strike up a conversation with Umbridge. Hmm. That way, if she notices you, I can tell her you're my guest. And while she's distracted, I'll interrogate the guests and find out what they need to know. Will they not question why you're here? Looks like Umbridge is by herself. Now the chance. Go, go, go. Hmm. Good luck, Sarai. Time to turn on the rat charm, or at least her version of it. Do you know Rath well enough for that? I'll start interrogating the guests. Also, okay, I can just say I want cake. Shut up. Surprisingly, that only took two minutes. Well, that confirms it. Felix Cruz is definitely involved in the art world. Yeah, we know. But even though he's a member of the club, no one here has actually met him. Sarahi? Oh, that's actual wrath. How did it go? How did what go? Oh, that's actual wrath. Uh, what do you mean? Sarahi, I think I pulled it off. Long story, Rath. I will explain later. Oh, hi, Rath. Oh, hi, Rath. What is happening? It's a long story. I will explain later. Someone explain why I'm looking at myself. Now, immediately. Yes, I should have checked if the real Rath was going to show up. That would have been helpful. Uh, Who? What are you? Hmm. I'm not actually you, Rath. I'm Tonks. Tonks is a metamorphosis. Oh. Yeah, they never met. I hate this. Sly, did you put Tonks up to impersonating me? Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, it was my idea. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But I thought she asked you. But I can explain. Madam Umbridge kicked me out of the club and... Don't care. 
I vouched for you. This is how you'll pay me. Dude, I'm already kicked out. At this point, I did. There's nothing I can do. What in Merlin's beard is going on here? Wait, why am I telling her that? Okay, now this is just stupid. Okay, now I'm not reading any of this. Now I'm in tongues. I ain't reading any of this. None of this is canon. Come on, clumsy rat. I got what I need anyway. Time to head back to work. Yeah, I'll apologize to that later. This was necessary. I'm rich sucks. Also, we just needed to know about Felix Rules. The club does not matter. Sahi, what's the crack? I received your owl. It sounded urgent. I was able to get back in the social club and ask around. Wait until you hear what I learned about Felix Rules. Nothing. Y'all learned nothing. Oh, keep it down. Flumps been on high alert lately. Mm. You don't need him finding out for sharing information about the Fiend Fire case. I'll tell you what I learned, then you can tell me what it means for the case. You know you can chat outside the office so that Flump doesn't catch you. Like maybe at the bins. It's certainly suspicious that no one has met this Felix Bruce chap. I believe Ruby was getting closer to discovering the truth. Alright, makes you say that. Like, hey, is Felix also a part of art? Should we just assume that at this point? Ruby had Mr. Groove's name written in her book. Yes, we know that. Why are you repeating information? And she ended up at the art gallery where his paintings were being auctioned. I was there when Ruby was saying the art gallery. It was completely random. We said that in the last chapter already. Go ahead. Or perhaps that's what she wanted you to think. Y'all being sus of Ruby now? Uh, fair enough. She might have made it seem random, but she had every intention of getting that assignment. What if Ruby intended to be at the art gallery that day so she could continue working the case undirected? I have no idea what y'all are talking about. I have my doubts, Karen. You're talking about Ruby as if she's a manipulative mastermind. See, technically, according to the data mine, she is. Um, maybe, maybe not. But if I'm right, she may have been targeted for investigating Felix Cruz. Um, Which means you're now in as danger, Azar. Eh, that's a regular Tuesday for me. Then it's more important than ever that we convince Flump that our investigations are intertwined. Can you, can you all just like not bother convincing Flump? Once he has the Felix Cruz connection, he'll have to let me in on the screen fire investigation. I agree. Um, I last saw Flump and the Ministry all purpose room on my way here, but be careful, Sarahi. Flump is ready to fire you for disobeying him. You better make a strong case. If he fires me, I'm going to the magical creatures department and you all can shut up. Thanks, Kalam. I'll present the best argument I can. The rest will be in Flump's hands. Why are you all even bother convincing Flump? Just do your thing. Hi, Olivia. Sarahi, let's talk soon. It's not Jacob. Did he tell you did he tell you that he loves you yet? We need more developments on this front. Don't mind me, I'm just cataloging all the purposes of this whole purpose through. I see. It is nice I get to talk to Barnaby. Give me a second, love. Um, has anyone seen my part? Where has that asker gone? Sir, if you lost your dog, I think that, uh, sir, I, I think I need to be concerned about her bird. Hi, Barnaby! Hi! Hi! We just got a kiss. Two weeks ago, for the first time. Let me reiterate, why did we have to wait six years for that? Sarahi, hello! Barnaby, what a nice surprise. It's always nice to see you. I need to draw you again. You seem like you're in a hurry. I'm looking for my boss. I don't see him anywhere. Uh, Great, then you have a moment to chat. I have so much to tell you since we last talked. Okay, time spent with Barnaby is never time wasted. Unless it's a very stupid side quest in which we don't get to spend time with him. Yes, I'm talking about the bees again. There's no bathroom here. That's one purpose this room doesn't serve. Why would there not be a bathroom in the all-purpose room? Andra has explained his job to me 342 times and I still don't understand it. You counted how many times he explained it to you. But <laughs> you did I it's because he was more focused on counting how many times he explained it rather than actually listening to the explanation. It's like, yeah, that's funnier. Also, Barnaby, I love you, but what about Andre's job do you not understand? Like I'm genuinely curious what you don't understand. He is a stylist, right? Am I right about Andre being a stylist or did I also not understand Andre's job? He's a stylist at Gladrex, right? Like he's the one who will tell you what kind of color combinations will look good and what your complexion matches with, etc. Sounds like everything's coming up, Barnaby. It is. My job as a homemaster is full of fiery and huggable co-workers. That sounds so good, dude. I want to do that. And I love that the old gang still spends time together. You may finally be starting to feel better about life after Hogwarts. Well, it's good. I've been talking about myself the whole time. We love to hear you talk about yourself. You don't do that enough. I was work going for you, Sarahi. Frustrating. It's been frustrating. I have a mess that I just can't seem to clean up. Also, my boss sucks. I couldn't do what you do. It, it, I make too much of a mess on my own. I have brought an albino bloodhound home once in a ruined grandmom's carpet. I think that's just what dogs do. I think their grandmother is the problem here. I'm so glad I ran into you, Sai. You made my brilliant day even brillianter. 
Do not use the word brilliant. I it just reminds you of brilliant diamond, and that game sucked. Why did I play brilliant diamond? Oh yes, I wanted sin or ribbons. Oh hi! It's been a while since we saw that man. Barnaby, isn't that your uncle? It is Uncle Cecil over here. It's me, Barnaby. Oh hey, we haven't seen this dude in a while. Barnaby, Uncle Cecil, what are you doing here? I have terrible news. Oh boy. I really don't like Barnaby's grandmother, but that's still really bad. God damn it, 2024 isn't going great for Barnaby either, is it? Oh Barnaby. Oh love. Oh no. Man, I never thought I'd feel bad for Barnaby's grandmother of all people. Actually, scratch that. I feel bad for Barnaby. You all remember how back in 2020 they ruined our high of Valentine's Day by killing Ro on the next week. At least they had the decency to wait two weeks now to ruin Barnaby's high. I wouldn't call that good decency. Four years later, it happens again. Just took an extra week, and this time it happened to an in-game character, not to us. Still feels just as bad. Ah! Not that boy. <laughs> oh God! I don't like. I don't like that. I don't want him to cry. <laughs> Barnaby, I'm so sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Condolences. Drinks around the house today. Thanks, Marula. Penny, I don't like this. <laughs> Jack Sunny, why do you do this? I can't say you do this every time. You only did this like in 2020, and now you're doing it again in 2024. Hi, Sarah. Thank you for organizing this. Oh, I did this. I was not aware. Of course, I was in the middle of a big breakthrough at work when news of Randy's grandmother came in. That must have been a stressful moment for you. I Frick work. All I could, all I could do was think about taking care of Pandi. That's literally all my thoughts right now. I don't like this, Penny. I don't like this. I'm sad. I want to cry. Suddenly, work could wait. Work can wait indefinitely. Barnaby needs. Barnaby needs. Barnaby needs. You're a good friend to Barnaby. I was freaking covered, and I, I can't. I can't see him crying. It's too sad. He's quite upset. Yeah, no kidding. Well, let's do our best to console him. What is it about Beyond Hogwarts that people keep dying? First, it was Ruby that died, and now it's Barnaby's grandmother. And at least we can't say this for that because that's a grandmother. I feel like I should be the bad. Actually, no. Shut up. Shut up, Gibby. I don't know how to say how I feel. That's okay, now. That's okay. That's okay. I don't know what to do in this situation because we know we don't like Barnaby's grandmother. What do I do in this situation? What will you do with that big drafty house? All right, the I know I shouldn't be asking this question, but who's getting the inheritance? It better be him. Can something good happen in 2024? Can one good thing happen in 2024? This year sucks in every way, shape, and form. Okay, yes, I know we had the first kiss on Valentine's Day, but first of all, why we had to wait six years? And secondly, they ruined our high in 2020 with Rowan, and now they ruined Barnaby's. It would make you feel better. I can prank for Ola. Not today, at you left. Are they not gonna let me like even hug Barnaby or give him a kissy on the forehead? Okay, the kissy isn't necessary. Can I hug at least? I don't like seeing Barnaby so sad. Yeah, me neither. I don't like this situation, Penny. Penny, I don't like this situation. Ah! Y'all better let me hug. Jam City, y'all better let me hug. It is hug time. My band here was having a brilliant day, and Jam City read bed. Let's see how long that lasts. Thank you, everyone. I don't know how to say how I feel. That's okay, Mom. That's okay. It's all right, Barnaby. Take your time. Love you. I'm sad, but part of me is happy that you're all here. Then I feel bad for feeling happy. It's all right. But more than anything, I feel loved. You are loved. Everyone loves you. Anyone that doesn't like Barnaby can explode and boil in lava. You can feel however you want, Barnaby. There's no wrong way to grieve. I'm not used to this many thoughts in my head at once. I need to focus on just the one. You want to write stuff down? I have a pen and paper. What do you think about in tragic times like this? What's the problem? Love is all you need, Barnaby. Life would be pretty lonely without love. I didn't get to tell my grandma I loved her before she left. We have to tell people we love them while we can. No comments. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not commenting on his grandmother. I'm not doing it. I love you and everyone here. Say, ah, thanks. We love you too. Everyone loves you, Barnaby. Everyone loves him. If you don't, well, shut up. It reminds me of now. Don't mention Rod. Don't mention Rod. We do not need to talk about what happened in 
So I need to focus on you one week. No, Sly, tell me. I need something to keep my mind off Tanma. If you say Ruby instead of Rowan, I swear to God, MC. Okay, th- wait, what? I see of Jacob. He could learn a thing or two from this. He has something important he should tell Olivia and should tell her while he can. Oh, that's... That's a fair point. Thank you for being here for me, Sly. Oh, Span, we all love you. We love you. We all love you here. The game won't let me, but I'll give you a hug and a kiss you on the forehead. If you'll excuse me, I have to get back to Uncle Cecil at Grandmom's house. Anytime, Anami. Before I go back to my boss, I have to tell Jacob it's time to come clean with Olivia. I don't think it's time yet for those two. As much as I need, like, developments there, I don't think it's time. I don't think it's a good time yet. It's not a good time, MC. I think that's the other chapter also. What in the name of God's green earth is happening in 2024? It is the 1st of March. It is the 2nd of March. What is happening this year? None of what has happened in January, February bodes well for what's going to happen for the rest of this year. Should I even start a new channel this year? Everything seems like it's ending in disaster this year. Why are there so many disasters? Why have been why have been there why has there been so many disasters in 2 months? Or 2024. I would go to the bathroom, but I can't even do that at least. Like seriously, what what is going on? Is this bad juju because I don't go to the gym? For context, my uh, New Year's resolution would be that I would start going to the gym. And then I looked at the membership prices for my local gym, and I, then we had the financial crisis, and I was like, yeah, with the financial crisis, obviously I'm I'm not paying for a gym membership. I, I ain't doing it. Is this is this because I didn't do my New Year's resolution of going to the gym because I had a financial crisis and I didn't want to pay for gym membership? Is this bad juju because I just decided that going to the gym would be a waste of money? I should just jog in the park instead. Is, is this why? Is this why the universe is upset? And heck, it is. It is bleeding into the world of Hogwarts mystery. And the bad news having a brilliant day. And the game said, yeah, no, yeah, no, no. You do the luck to be hit. I'm frustrated about everything. I don't know what to do in this situation. Ah. Bye.